Hello, my friend, and welcome to Wisdom Trek. I am Guthrie Chamberlain, your guide to wisdom and creating a living legacy. Thank you for joining us for this five-day-per-week wisdom and legacy-building podcast. This is day 602 of our trek, and it is time for a three-minute mini-trek called Wisdom Unplugged. This short nugget of wisdom includes an inspirational quote with a little bit of additional content for today's trek. Consider this your vitamin supplement of wisdom for today. So let's jump right in with today's nugget. And today's quote is from Sada Param, who said, The search for wisdom is a great challenge. To act on wisdom is an even greater challenge. Gaining wisdom seems to be an ever-elusive challenge. I believe that most people desire to be wise, but they are unwilling to face what is required to gain wisdom and become wise. Wisdom has to be a passion that you seek more fervently than you desire monetary gain. In Proverbs chapter 8, Lady Wisdom encourages us to Choose my instruction rather than silver, and knowledge rather than pure gold. For wisdom is far more valuable than rubies. Nothing you desire can compare with it. There is also a fine line between having intellectual wisdom and actually putting that wisdom into action on a daily basis with our decisions and choices that we make. Proverbs chapter 13, verse 16 tells us, Wise people think before they act. Fools don't and even brag about their foolishness. So a truly wise person has both a head knowledge of wisdom and they also put that wisdom into practice each day in the decisions and choices that they make. Gaining wisdom does take a desire, effort, discipline, and a faith in God that does not waver. In addition to desiring wisdom more than riches, James chapter 1 verses 5 through 8 shows us the formula for gaining wisdom. And this is what James tells us. If you need wisdom, ask our generous God, and He will give it to you. He will not rebuke you for asking, but when you ask Him, be sure that your faith is in God alone. Do not waver, for a person with divided loyalty is as unsettled as a wave on a sea that is blown and tossed by the wind. Such people should not expect to receive anything from the Lord. Their loyalty is divided between God and the world, and they are unstable in everything they do. Well, that's a wrap for today's Wisdom Unplugged quote. If you'd like free access to my database of over 10,000 inspirational quotes, the link is available on the main page of wisdom-track.com. And just as you enjoy these nuggets of wisdom, encourage your friends and family to join us and then come along with us tomorrow for another day of Wisdom Trek, creating a legacy. If you'd like to listen to any of the past treks or read the daily journal, they are available at wisdom-track.com. You can also subscribe on iTunes or Google Play so that each day's trek is downloaded to you automatically. And thank you so much for allowing me to be your guide, your mentor, but most importantly, I am your friend, as I serve you through the Wisdom Trek podcast and journal each day. And as we take this trek of life together, let us always live abundantly, love unconditionally, listen intentionally, learn continuously, Lend to others generously, lead with integrity, and then leave a living legacy each day. I am Guthrie Chamberlain, reminding you to keep moving forward, enjoy your journey, and then create a great day every day. See you tomorrow for Philosophy Friday.